you still have a Windows XP computer, here's how you can make it look like Windows 7. In the description is a zip file. Once you've extracted it, you'll know a folder with seven folders all representing their own steps. First, you have to install the theme, so just go to the theme folder and double click on it. Once your personalized window pop up, just click OK and apply. Now you notice that your background will change. Just go to Styler folder now and click Then First Run Me to install the program Styler. Then click on Then Run Me and then Find Styler in your Start menu, then Find in your System Tray. Once you double click on Styler, click on the Windows 7 theme and it should make it look a lot more like Windows 7. Now it's time for the iconized taskbar hack. Once you've installed this and logged out and logged back in again, you should notice only icons on your taskbar. Now for the fonts, you can go back into Styler and apply the fonts, but I'm not going to do that. Now it's time for the icons. So, when you first install Icon Tweaker, then click Then Run Me. And when you click Apply, it should change all your icons to Windows 7 icons. Next is Arrow Shake. Once you've installed Arrow Shake and it puts a button in your system tray, all you have to do is shake your window and the one behind it should disappear. I don't know why it didn't work there. Arrow Snap basically works as the same thing. All you have to do is just run through the installation to put an icon in your system tray. Now you should be able to snap windows, but for me it doesn't work for some reason. Now just go into the next taskbar shuffle folder and install it. This should be able to make you be able to drag and drop icons in your taskbar like Windows 7. Next is Drive Icons. So once you've installed the program, just open up your computer and you should see a little percentage bar that shows you how much hard drive space you have left. The last step is Show Desktop. And once you've run this, and once again it doesn't work for me, you should be able to show your desktop like you do in Windows 7. Now to revert, just go to right click and click settings and then change your theme back to Windows XP. Now go on your computer, Windows, Resources, and Themes to find the theme that you've installed. You're going to want to delete the file and the folder. And now you can close out of all the programs in your system tray. Now just go into all the folders and click on the iconized taskbar hack, click uninstall, log out, log back in again. Then go into the icon tweaker and you're going to want to restore all these items one by one by just clicking on it and click restore. And this should restore them all back to Windows XP looking icons. Now keep in mind, you could have just set a restore point, but this is the manual way to do it and it doesn't really take that long, so I recommend just doing it this way instead of having to restore your computer. So once you've um, restored all icons, all you have to do is just click apply and OK. Now if you go back to the uh, desktop and go to control panel and go to add and remove, we're going to un uninstall all the programs that we installed. Once you're done, just click on the two folders on your desktop and delete them. And there, you're back to the original XP machine. Please be sure to check out our website and follow us on all popular social networks. Alright, that's it for this video, guys. I'll see you next time.